we've seen him doing music videos we've seen him in the ott space we've seen him on tv is there anything that karan kundra can't do let's find out Today we have with us none other than Karan Kundra. We've seen you as the host before. How do you, as a host, change as far as what is required? My approach towards uh, any of the reality shows which involve uh, people uh, as contestants is very, very human. Everybody has a personality. Everybody has uh, tendencies to react. When it comes to different reality shows, it's always the format uh, and then the approach that I take on as a host for that format. So one of the most celebrated act actors on social media and you have such a large presence and that love is reciprocated what you give the fans the fan gives you backward yes. how much do you think it's contributed to making you where you are today whatever i am today is because of that let's be very very honest yes uh, you know everybody is a good actor everybody right. is a good host everybody right. is working extremely extremely hard uh, in this industry and uh, i i think uh, i'm very lucky that uh, i get a lot of love like anyone who's fallen in love or you know likes love all things romance loves the relationship that you you share i'm sure you have to be mindful of what you put up when there's another person involved as well right i i think uh, it's 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 a give and take yeah it's also about what have you experienced in life it's right. also as i said like just like temptation yeah. island you know um being a part of a show which is very similar which is captive right. reality right. i understood myself first you're in a, a situation where you're cut off from the outside world there is no uh, inputs coming in from uh, say you know your friends or your family you whatever decision you are taking right. is just you right and not your manager not your family not yeah. your friends you know so that brings out exactly what you like right. and what you dislike right. what people you like what people you are not okay with right. it makes you very sure of who right. you are so makes your relationship very successful mm -hmm. because now you know i want exactly this type of girl or i want exactly what she brings right. to me the right. the calmness the happiness right. the turmoil right. this is what i want and you know cosmopolitan we do a lot of relationship articles like because the audience is such yeah. and we can learn about a lot about the relationship that you and tejas we share <laughs> so how do you know yeah. how do you and tejas we bring the best out of each other i think just the way that we are uh, formulated <laughs> right we we might be exactly opposite uh, for the right reasons we might be very similar for the right reasons i think uh, we just found each other and uh, when i think the best part is that when we were falling in love with each other people were already falling in love with the idea that these two can be together because okay. my advice again for everybody who's uh, you know who goes going in and out of relationships because right. i have been in and out of relationships right. is find out what you really are okay. and what's your love language like how do you express your feeling are you someone who's grand on gestures or are you just there for her how, how do you communicate first of all i think i tempt her a lot okay okay that's <laughs> second yeah so my love language is uh, about the little things and okay. hers is as well okay if her language was about grand gestures then i would have made my love language about grand, grand gestures, gestures. Okay. but it is about the little things for her and i do all the little things one thing that you like and one thing that you wish reality shows change about See again, as I said, I've been a part as, uh, of a lot of reality shows exactly. as con as a contestant yeah. one and as a host uh, to right. uh, some, uh, and now again, Temptation Island in India. What I like about reality shows is something that you, when you are going through that process, right. it changes you for the rest of your life. Right. Right. Any show, be it Roadies, be it Love School, be it uh, you know Big Boss, obviously Big Boss in a very massive way, uh, even Temptation Island for that matter. everybody who's come in it it's it's like it's like life on steroids right. you know it's all the simulation all the hardships that are going to come it they're coming in the form of you know all the tasks that are being put on right. put through you so you learn so much that when you come out you're a completely different person mm -hmm. which i really like okay. because it can be more for the good and if you're very stuck up in life right so if you're open to learning huh. if you're open to experience experiencing and uh, evolving then reality shows in 3 months will give you the experience of say 10 years okay and one thing you wish like changes like you would see better 
so that we see better reality shows you feel again uh, it's the audience okay i'll be a little uh, honest here uh, we have to give what the audience wants, wants. so it is up to totally up to you for the better or the worse what would you describe your fashion and personal style like you know because you're also a style icon to i would say that i really don't uh, think much okay because uh, uh, for me what i think and what i speak is more important than what i wear okay right and i've always kept it like that i'm more of a thinker and a talker so i'm I, i'm actually a, a, any stylist's uh, dream <laughs> because okay. whatever they want to put me in because they know i'm going to not really think about it right. so they think it's confidence it's actually uh, uh, the fact that i don't even know <laughs> okay so whatever you know so i really it's about the confidence that okay. you have because i don't think when i walk into a room people are looking at my clothes right. they're actually looking at what i am and you know tv ott music videos also you know this requires a lot of energy and dedication so you know what keeps you going i think i'm very passionate about the art that i'm you know uh, in or the line that i'm in i'm very excited uh, you know if you see me on sets you'll you'll be uh, looking at somebody who's extremely involved and it's not just ki theek hai 12 ghante de rahe hain aur ho gaya abhi ja raha hu i'm extremely involved with the creative side you know what do we do how do we make it better i i, I think it i was born for this okay yeah. very passionate you're willing to take risk there's an equal worry while there's an equal like okay you know what i'm going to do this i'm going to kick ass in it so yeah. and that's made you such a successful star um yes i do take risks uh to be honest uh for me uh before i came into this industry i'd already uh made my money okay okay so i was 22 23 and uh, so i knew how to make money because i was already running my call center and everything to wo ho gaya tha now i wanted to do something that is uh you know so my approach towards this wasn't a very stable approach right okay there are people who come into in the, in the industry they uh, they have they, they acquire a very stable approach that this is the ladder we have to do this this right. this, this my approach was totally Different. uh 90 degrees <laughs> <laughs> off I wanted to do crazy things. Right. I wanted to do stuff that people don't do uh and make it look cool. Yeah. After giving such big uh you know daily shows and becoming a brand you nobody said uh, nobody recommended mm. uh, a crime show right. because they were like are wo to aap you will have time when you turn 40 you should do right. it. I was like no yeah. we have to do it. No. So I think uh, when I uh, I've always maintained that the journey is more important than the destination. So when I look back I want to go and uh, you know I I'm, I'm, I'm want to go back look back and see this and I dare to do what others never did and out of all the formats which one satisfies you the most so which is, uh, makes you more at comfort or again as i said i'm very comfortable with all formats i love being on a film set uh, because of the way yeah. things are done and the kind of inputs right. that go through and the just just the fact that it's so thorough right you know and it's also very a lot of fun uh i love being on tv shows uh i love love uh, reality shows like temptation island india because as i said it's it's there are human beings right and how human beings react and how right. they think and right. what are they going to react yeah. like it's it's a it's a you know it's a brain game right. for us is right. like you know being part of the makers yeah. so it's very ex- interesting to you know sort of um pitch them against each right. other or to bring out the best in, each, in them in them right. and they look at they look up to me and you know because they know I'll never let anything bad happen to them right. and that confidence in that uh, you know uh, to create something like that and to come out uh, you know with flying colors is okay. exciting and thank you so much karan that's thank you so much wonderful 